Everybody, it's the moment you've all been waiting for. It's the final award of the night. <laughs> I do want to take this opportunity on a serious note to say something, though. Um, we're living in times uh, of divisiveness and turmoil and instability right now. But in times like these, music is a language that connects us all. It gives us hope. And it tears down walls and barriers and helps prevent them from going up in the fucking first place. And it transcends difference in race and color and religion. And it makes us feel like no matter where you're at, no matter where you're from, when you hear that song, you're home. And I feel at home in a room full of people that help create that, that help enable that and encourage and perpetuate that. And I just want to say, we need you, all of you more than ever, to use your voice and to share your talents. So please don't stop. And don't stop realizing the importance or the value of what that means and the honor we have as the creators and the enablers is such a special and sacred responsibility that none of us in here should take lightly or, gra or for granted. I believe in all of you, and I know that if we stick together, we'll come through this stronger on the other side, okay? So just keep going. We saved the best for last, ladies and gentlemen. Here are your nominees for Rock Album of the Year. Rock Album of the Year. Arkells. Like Monster Truck. The Sheepdogs. The Trues. Three Days Grace. And the rock album of the year is Billy Talent. Oh my God. <laughs> That'll be next year. Uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, they deserve it. They're all of those, every single band nominated are dear friends of ours and we're proud of all of them. But we're also proud of this band because they're such good human beings and are doing so much to keep rock and roll alive in this country when it's needed most. Ladies and gentlemen, the Arkells. team and our partners, uh, Chris Taylor, Queen Ashley, Jack Ross, Adam Countryman. Uh, there's been so much wisdom shared on the stage tonight, but uh, our friend Jeremy didn't get a chance to finish, so he's going to finish the night as he should. Jeremy, come on, let's go. Hey, go. Get in there. And don't cut off the fuck, don't start the music. He's going to go as long as he wants, okay? This is what giving space holds like. This is what holding space looks like. Thank you. To my manager, I'm sorry, I have joined the Arkells. I will not be. <laughs> they just have, they have a better rider. And um, it's an honor to be the sixth member? Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, <laughs> as I was saying. Reconciliation. Reconciliation. 
It's a lofty goal. It's a dream. And it doesn't happen in a year. It takes time. It takes stories. It takes shared experience. It takes music. I have hope. I have to. That we can come to right relations with each other. You know? And if at least we're not in the same book, at least we're on the same page. At least if we're not on the same page, or at least we're in the same book. I should get my anecdotes right. I just want to say this. Niga niyang to be the Thank you.